Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So as you guys can see by the title, this video is going to be a video on my hermit crab, Gunner. So I know that I don't make a lot of hermit crab videos on my channel or not as many as you guys would like me to, but the one and only reason why I don't make a lot of hermit crab videos on my channel is because you guys know I've made multiple videos in the past on the topic of owning hermit crabs and they're just not an animal that I encourage people to go out and get and I don't encourage people to go out and buy them. They're heavily mistreated and they die by the thousands every year because of this mistreatment. They're a highly misrepresented and misunderstood animal even in pet stores. Pet stores encourage horrible care for them and just all around hermit crabs dying so quickly in the hands of children and things like that. It's just not something that I condone. It's not something that I encourage and I just wish that they weren't sold in pet stores altogether. But today's video is not about all of that. That's just my little disclaimer on why I don't make tons of videos on my hermit crabs. But today's video is rather on something that hermit crabs do that I've never actually showed you guys. I've never talked about it much and I've also never been able to film it or capture it for you guys. So while I was cleaning my pet room today and I was, as you can see, little Moo is out. While I was cleaning my pet room today and taking care of Moo and I was about to feed the hermit crabs, I did notice that Gunner, my smallest and also my most purple little hermit crab, was out and he was shell shopping, as I like to call it. He was going around to all of the empty turbo shells in his tank and he was filling them up and he was checking to see if there was one that he liked and he was looking for one to move into. I decided since I've never really showed you guys hermit crab shell shopping or rather changing shells, I thought that I would film this experience so that you guys could see what it's like for one of my crabs whenever they do choose to move shells. It's a really interesting thing to see. It is very fascinating. Hermit crabs are such a fascinating little creature. I love crustaceans, especially crabs, like hermit crabs. They're just so fascinating to watch and observe. And that was one of the biggest reasons why I did get them almost 10 years ago. I just find them so fascinating. And Gunner especially is such a beautiful purple. He's a lot of fun to watch. My hermit crabs are very friendly. They're definitely not that timid. Gunner is my most timid one of the two that I have but it is the middle of the day and he was out in the open changing shells which is not something that you see a lot of this is something that you don't really see a lot of hermit crabs do let alone in the day but while you're watching them because they are usually scared of human presence they're not really a friendly animal or pet to have but again I think my hermit crabs really do trust me after nine years with me they know that I'm not gonna touch them they know that if I'm near their tank or in their tank I'm changing their food changing their water or misting them down and that is it so yeah I think that he was comfortable doing it in front of me and I was able to catch that on film for you guys if you guys enjoy this hermit crab video feel free to subscribe down below and also hit the notification bell so yeah I was able to catch Gunner on camera changing shells I hope you guys enjoy
smallest hermit crab. He is growing rapidly though. I've noticed him molt a couple times in the past few months, so he is definitely growing. Both Gunner and SpongeBob are both doing really well. I do see them out from time to time, but Gunner was out today, so I thought that I would film him and hope that you guys enjoyed seeing a little bit of him. It's really important that you always provide your hermit crabs with plenty of shells to change into. I have an entire video on hermit crab shells and how many you should offer and what types and things. I will link that video down below for you guys as well as on the screen. I have an entire playlist of hermit crab videos that I have accumulated over the past year on my channel. If you guys are interested in watching any of my hermit crab videos, I will have that playlist linked on the screen as well. It's just so important to always provide your hermit crabs with the proper shells. I prefer turbo shells and always have them clean and facing up. That's something that I always make sure to offer my hermit crabs so that whenever they do want to go shell shopping and they want to do a change, there's always tons of shells readily available. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you guys in my next video. Be kind. Bye.